the real AI tech is generations beyond what you think it is. There's ChatGPT, you know, GPT-4, Claude 3, um, Gemini, Gemini Pro, all that stuff. That's for us to play with. That's for us to play with and get acclimated with and accept the real shit. I don't even know if I should say this. The real technology that they get to play with, that they have, that they've had for years, makes what we play with a child's toy. It's absolutely nothing. Probably wondering, okay, well, how the hell does this guy know? Who the fuck is he? I was shown things and have seen things and have heard things with my own ears and eyes that weren't really ever meant for me. And that's part of the reason why I can't exactly disclose who I am at this point. I'm not sure how that will go. I don't necessarily want to be, uh, you know, black band, right? But I will say this. Unless you are physically in the presence of a single person or you've known them personally, physically, if you've only had interactions via email, phone calls, hell, even video messaging, if that is your only course of being able to verify, then you don't know. A lot of you probably work for AI or are friends with AI and you don't even know it. When this was first revealed to me, and I saw it, and I saw just how capable it was, not only how capable it was today, but how capable it was years ago. I'm not talking last year, I'm talking years ago. I couldn't sleep. And all I could think was my kids. And what are they going to do? What do their futures look like? You know, what could they possibly take in university that isn't replicatable? by AI. A lot of people sit there and say, okay, well, go become a plumber. And do a trade. Okay, sure. A lot of people will. And then we're going to have a supply and demand issue as office buildings that used to house employees. Um, customer service jobs that are now done by AI no longer require maintenance. They don't require a plumber to come up and fix a leaky pipe in a building that's not even got tenants. No builds, no new builds, no new money, no new mortgages, no new housing, no new work for trades. So my question to these leaders, which I have yet to get an answer for them, or some have, but you don't want to know the answer, is if everything is done by AI and AI is doing all the jobs, who is buying your product? Who is buying your widget, your gadget, your gizmo, whatever it is that you make? Who's buying it? Nobody has money. Is it AI buying it? Is AI putting in these purchase orders for an electrician to come out and wire up a building that it sits in? No, it's not. The answer is nobody's buying it. They are literally killing the golden goose. They know that. 